Do they not run the two mana spell on their list? Wow, they don't run the two mana spell from. Okay, I'm right in the. Let me look at their list on the picture. Yeah, no two mana spell. Okay. So, are you thinking? Um, what do I do here now? Is Embrace just nuts here? It's just terrible here. It doesn't draw anything. So I don't know. We don't have the two mana spell there. Did you just not peel? Sometimes I used to always peel and then somebody like convinced me not to peel and now sometimes I do both. I'll, I'll save for the second one here. Solar crystal cluster is not good next turn. Shiny, my shiny. Um. I don't know. 
I kind of want to yog steal their four drop because they look like pretty low on value here. Are you thinking? So I don't get anything from stealing their four drop, right? I don't have like a death rattle minion, right? Uh, so maybe it's incorrect. Just kill this and then play a bunch of cards. I don't know what I'm looking for here. I regret not going Yogg now. I think I just gain infinite armor next turn. No gems. It's getting rough early again. I know all the steps. Bro, infinite scorpions over here? What is this nonsense? Alright, wait, I'm, and I'm getting immolated chat. Okay, I have Finley, we'll be fine. But still. This is kind of hilariously huge. Um, I might just take control of the steel hide here. Wait, oh, what? My map? Right now, I think I go Yogg um, just to kill this stuff.
Why do they keep getting the same ones, chat? Right. That's kind of weird. Your card burns. There are there any lethals here with like a shattered on? Ragnaros. I feel like there aren't here. No. Too many beasts. Uh, is this useful? Three, two, four. Whoops, that's a huge blunder chat. I was supposed to play, um, uh, God. I, and I was supposed to go Finley there too, so uh, I kind of, a little slow, sorry. That was a huge blunder. I have no card draw. Ugh, uh, Finley would've been great too. Cause my hand, my deck is juicy. I get my due processes going. Ticking. Ah, I hit my, my poisony boy. Wait, they turned my rag into a rag here? It's kind of funny. At least they're overloaded for a ton for next turn. Be, is that good that it went face or bad? I don't even know. Okay, I probably just have to be lame here. What was the secret? It was, um... Does anyone know what the, remember what the secret was? Um, cat trick, cat trick. Okay, okay, okay. So let's do this first, so... Before, um... Uh, 
I think I'm just gonna be lame here. I think it's correct, especially with the lifesteal on board. I think it's just correct to be lame. I think I want to... Do I want to destroy the test here? Probably. Yeah, they have another break chance. Let's go, dude. Actually, it's sick. That's kind of funny. Yeah, it is true. They go to die. All right. I have too many more. Got him.
I think I'm gonna die. Premier Druid Degens, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just kinda wanted to play. I don't know if this list is, uh. so dead here like they just pop off and they win it's not very hard I right. oh, no pop off here yes, lucky is this really um it's our best top deck i don't know I feel like I'm surprised this list doesn't run double wild growth and like double embrace and like I don't know I guess it just like seems um, questionable like it's got all the big ramp cards but I mean I guess you're supposed to go pendant of earth on three um, and just gain a ton of life and that's like what's supposed to prevent you from dying I ran out of mana for Murlocs, which is kind of interesting. I just got that. What do I do here now? Need top deck triple innervate here. Right, um, if I hit solar, maybe I could win here. This is not solar. Not dead hands gamer, but probably dead hands gamer. I'm not throwing away my shot. If three rights make a left. They will never catch me. Dude, if we pull off the scam here, I'm gonna be amazed. Oh, they have enough like, direct damage to win here.
Wait, what if they effed up here, chat? Oh my god, chat. Wait, what? Is this really than ah! Chat, sometimes that hits my dragon there. And we probably still die, but, like, you know how it is. Kathun versus Toranda. Your path has brought you here. My dreaming ends. Your nightmare begins. Does getting paid make you less tilted uh, when losing to bullshit? Um, it's more like if you are if you're constantly getting tilted while losing to bullshit, um, you're not going to get paid for long because you're going to lose your emotions um, and you're going to lose you're going to fail at your job. That that is more like it. It's not uh, the the money doesn't. It's more like is like does being a doctor make you uh, good at medicine it's more like if you're not good at medicine you're not going to be a doctor for long if that makes sense Say in the lucky top deck. I just take two low cost dragons here. I could take another nourish as well, just ramp. I could also just take an innervate. Let's take the innervate. I have another ramp in hand, so... So, like, I don't mind the mech. It's actually, like, not even correct for them to draw a bunch of cards, in my opinion, um, in this matchup. Because, like, a, 
because now it just makes it so much easier for me to do process win uh, where they want to give themselves more time um, like the way you win this matchup is aggressive automatons um, I'd like they're doing this like they get some four sixes down but I have 20 life so I think I should be okay wait they're in fan club this is this is kind of suicide okay they're not even automatons here don't run fan club and all Sweet, beautiful water. Water. perhaps they have Tony I'm not hitting card draw. And I used both my, my nourishes. Um, I don't really have much card draw left in my deck. I'm not hitting the due processes. So I'm kind of in trouble here. Why not hydrate the Naga? Um, I thought hero powering is better, but because they could just trade the Naga off with their 8-8, but maybe that's incorrect. Yeah, I don't know. I hit I hit Solar freaking Frost Lotus, which is a ton of draw. I've just like not hit Due Process. I've not hit like Eonar. I've not hit any of like my big high value cards. Oh, what's due process deck? That's how you win. So. Hmm. You know, off the top would be insane here. Wow, they just switched to my. That's kind of a very nice win condition. All right, we're gonna go Finley. I have E and R, but that's not for next turn. And I have that spell, so I don't it's hard for me to actually make E and R work here. Oh god. Well I don't know what to do. Do this. I'll pass. I'm not even gonna trade. I think I really need Yogg here to be honest. It's a nice play by them. I mean, if they do something that doesn't set up lethal, maybe we have a chance here. Wait, they're just- oh, they're just running weird builds. I've 
bestow these gifts upon the world. The virtue of the wild. I feel like I need to hit Yogg here. Naga Giant doesn't really do it here, in my opinion. I don't know. I, I, I lost this. Slumber once Ah, I see the broadcast. And now, the premiere act. Me! Completely safe. Just don't spill it. Well, why did I play my Crypt Keeper there, chat? Uh, okay. Oh, so they couldn't rush this in, that's fine. Now, the premiere act! Me!
Well, this is a weird one because like on one end we like we want to spend our mana but another end like our plays for next turn are just kind of too insane so i do this like if i, I, I can go i go eonar and then i go the shattered reflections it's just too good Yeah, my um, I think my dude is ready. Uh, my Reno should be ready for next turn, right?
dead? I know. Okay. Okay. Hanging in there, hand the gamer chat. Oh, Rehydra would have been so nice. Rehydra was kind of the nuts there. Um, what do I want at the bottom of my deck, even? Um, am I better off full healing here, or am I better off um, clearing some board? It's like, I can go Reno here, right? Ooh. Could be good, right? Feel that healing beat. The virtue of the wild. Is Chaos Creation lethal? Almost. It's completely safe. Oh, they have a 50-50 they have a 50-50 on Chaos Creation for lethal here. Right? Oh, unlucky, bro. The right play. Go for the 50-50. Couldn't have done it better myself. Almost out of time. Chat, uh, let me tell you in short stream. I'm gonna end the stream in about an um, hour and a half, two hours and a half. But slider. Candle, but slider.
Oof, this is bad. Bro, uh, this 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 was kind of illegal. Illegal. All right, give me a pendant of earth off the top, please. I'm kind of screwed here, to be honest. Wait, oh, I have Yogg next turn. We're okay. We're okay. Wow, what a powerful like third curve is so good, but I just have Yogg like on turn uh on turn five Yogg. Like kind of saves us here. And then you and to follow up with Actually insane. And we have uh, this. Look at that, dude! Look at that! A witness the skill. Nice board you got there. Hmm. sometimes for nine mana is still like an okay card <laughs> and then other times you play it for zero mana
That seems good. Am I too big? You have no idea He's exercised so like his back. clear do I ever take Finley here over now, let's just take Naga Giant. It's 20 life. Let's be reasonable people here. Do you think Beetle is worth including in this deck? Um, Beetle is a different version that uh, some world-class players have done well with, uh, but it does worse for the average player, but it looks like it's okay overall. So um, it's hard to know at this point if the Beetle version is better or if better players are playing the Beetle version. We don't really know. Um, so, or if the better players have a skill advantage, like they have an information advantage where other players aren't good enough at playing against the Beetle. These are all possible things that it could be. So, and like I said, we don't really know, so. I give him a lot of card draw here, but like, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna get Reno down and like win the game. So. Oh, I give up there, man. Yeah. So I I, I don't really see like uh, objective evidence that it's bad. Like that it's uh, like I don't see like a very clear like it's worse. Um, Mildred is just more the 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 established uh, established strong archetype. If that makes sense, 
uh, where Beetle is the more experimental. Um, and like I said, uh, one, it has okay stats, I believe. Uh, okay, it has worse stats. Um, except, okay, like it's worse. There's one build that has an insane stats and every other build that's like out of 280 games, which means like somebody's really good at it and high rolling and whatever. But uh, most of the builds have worse stats. Um, I mean, the interesting, the, the build that's doing really well doesn't even run a uh, Anubicon. I don't know if that's the one uh, Insane was playing. Um, if you consider it, cold, cold Light Article might make the cut in this deck. So, I don't know. Thompson! Do not doubt my power. My dreaming ends. Your nightmare begins. With his regular deck, yeah. So, um, so the, 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 the short answer is we don't know. Um, uh, like, this deck is very strong. We do know that. We don't know if the beetle is strong, but it could be. So that's kind of the, like the predicament we're in there, you know? And now, the premiere act. I think I'm gonna play through processes. I don't know. I'm really just playing that two mana spell to uh, discount Naga Giants here. And now the mm, it's really bad. Me. Oh, let's go Temple Renthal here. The time has come to dethrone our former master. Innervate, 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 innervate. So was, okay, here's the truth about the beetle. Beetle is the best deck in the game, unless you're terrible. So if you go play the beetle deck, and you don't crush it, it not only means, it not only means that you're bad at that deck, but you don't really have much value as a human being, unfortunately. Like the beetle test, like in some cultures, uh, they, uh, parents will test, uh, their, their son or daughter's date with a beetle and see how they react. And if they react poorly, they, uh, have them executed. <laughs> you know how it is, chat. <laughs> Chat, was that better? Do you guys like that? I don't know what I'm looking for. Either. I have to hit like a uh, pendant here and I didn't hit pendant. So 
Solar Pendant could have done it here, but uh, was, wow, that was terrible. Here we go, here we go. Oh, double do, double do, double do, double do. All right, we got contract quarter on curve. That's what we've been needing here, chat. Ah, I see you've brought guests. I see you've brought guests. Wait, chat, chat, chat. Okay. Do you in this spot go Pannon? Or do you go Welp Wrangler? I'm gonna go Pannon. It's like actual cards in my deck. Welp Wrangler is better for things like uh, Fee, to like discount Fee, but. And, but like. I decided to go this because I'm actually going to start overdrawing here pretty fast, so... All right, chat. We got El Natos. Okay, this was this was a really good turn, chat. This was like a really good turn. The overture is upon us. Ah. 
I bestow these gifts upon the world. The virtue of the wild. Solar is insane. Alright, they got the uh, they got the professor. Do I die here? Like this two three? Do they have double? I can still just go Eonars again and like full heal here. Alright. Oh, they don't even have the full clear here. I've been starting to think about keeping Innervate because it like allows you get a turn. I think I'm gonna keep it. Allows you get Nourish down if you turn faster. If you draw Nourish, so. about keeping attorney and maw there attorney and maw is good to, to, to for the scourge illusionist right um but like i don't have a play for next turn um so i decided to just do this but could have been better correct Ooh, take to the skies is kind of a wait 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 what's more insane chat take to the skies which draws me topier guaranteed and fee and i have two innervates 
or <laughs> a rhythm and roots like rhythm and roots is so insane chat like uh, and like I don't have ramp for Topier anyway. I'm taking rhythm and roots here. Like that's so fast, you know. <clears throat> shiny, my shiny. I wonder if I was just supposed to, um, I don't know, um, but I don't know, I kind of want to ramp to 8 and then I can innervate Unar and just draw a full hand here. I have tempo now, so I don't have to, like... infinite cards but I only give one you know man what I get for a top deck freaking shattered reflections here It'd be so good Good play. Wait, what? Okay. Was that a good play? I'm not even sure. Alright, whatever. I bestow these gifts upon the world. The beauty of nature. Check, can I just put Doomsayer down here? Dude, I kind of like it. The end is coming. Solar here. kill my doomsayer they lose their whole board and then i just redevelop and win like there's no way i'm getting lethal here
Face, trade, trade, trade. Yep, that's correct. Maybe I just take this as a fizzle. It's like an insanely good fizzle, right? for another round. Another ancient chat. Do you like Control Priest? Uh, do I think it's strong right now? I don't really have any evidence for that. Um, but. Wait, I can, um, Shattered Reflections this and win the game. Draw three, draw three. Come on, what the heck, what the heck, what the heck? No, 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 no. My game is dying. Not now, not now. I need this turn, chat. Oh god. I don't have like if I have to restart the game I'm gonna lose, so I have to like wait and hope it unbugs. There we go. Good chat.
monsters beneath you. Did I have a lethal with the second Neptune there? Um, I might have missed lethal there, chat. I think I did. Wait, I could have had... Um... No, then it only deals eight, right? So it's uh, I could have done another eight to face, but... Nine to face, but... Oh no, chat. The attack of the stable game strikes back. Okay, here we go. No, 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 no. What is with my game chat? Oh, it's breaking. I can still hear it. No, no, no. What the heck, dude? What is up with this shit? This game is like, uh. Oh. I don't know, dude. Uh, miss five face, which is huge. You should restart. Okay, I'll restart. It's probably good. Uh, it's probably good to restart. Yeah. Dude, I don't even have like, I don't even have like uh, like crazy windows or anything open. It's just like Hearthstone client. <laughs> uh, check. I, I'll I want to make a two suit joke. Ah, <laughs> uh, dude. A fresh install? I don't know, Bricks. <laughs> okay, dude.
<laughs> it's good. Uh, unable to reconnect to my game, dude. Let's see if my rank went up. Maybe they conceded. Maybe they... So do you guys remember what my rank was before? Anyone remember? Anyone remember what my rank was? One hundred or so. What was exactly one hundred? Chat, you guys don't even know. All right, one oh seven. Chat, I'm li literally gonna go into the VOD right now uh, to see what time it is. It was exactly one one oh seven. Wow. What is it? Okay, which means my uh, it probably registered as a tie. Which means we both probably got discounted. Like you don't lose one rank for a loss, you lose more, so. This is a weird situation where I was going to um, just draw, but now that I drew, uh, I drew the, the Nourish here, uh, I probably forge this and then go coin the Nourish the next turn. Um, and then draw the second one. We have a good hand. Like, we have a very good hand. Unless we top deck Nourish here, then we're very sad. So if you're in this spot, I feel like we're better off. All right, so we could go pendant here and try to get a, a guy, or we could just go like cactus uh, and set up for solar pendant. I feel like solar pendant is so much armor. 
What do you guys think? I think I'm just gonna do this. Oh my god, that's such a high roll. Let's go, dude. Do I have a way to kill it myself? Not really. I can I can play it next turn though. <clears throat> so you don't even like trade off because I don't know, but yeah, this is Yeah, uh, okay, Doc. <laughs> I also could go Solar Crystal Cutter next turn, um, which is kind of a change of plans, Ray, but... <clears throat> On OTK, I don't uh, OTK Warlock? I don't know. Wait, maybe Solar Crystal Cutter is better here. What do you guys think? It's like so much ramp. I mean, it's like, it's three, it's five, like three, five, seven taunts. Like, how do they get through that, you know? It's actually an absurd amount of health, right? Like, look at that. Like, how do you beat that? I just put 14, 21, 28, 35 health on the board. That's like better than Pendant, like Solar Pendant was. So I decided to do this instead. Yeah, they just gave up. Wow. Does he watch? I don't know. I make my own. Your sacrifice will be for naught. Errors upon errors. Ah, I see you brought guests. I see you brought guests. Oh, chat, I was literally hoping for Pannon and I hit the Pannon. Wait, what was that? You guys see that gold? Like, you see that? Like, I've never seen that before. Does that happen every time and I've just never noticed it? Oh, wow, I've never noticed that, that, that gold on the... I, I, okay, it's like my friend. It's pretty sick, actually. The time is Oh, he finds the gold. I get it now. Okay, that's interesting. Okay. It's gold, Jay. It's all in gold. <laughs> He's looking for your stuff. Yeah. We have plotted long Now we rise. I don't know. <laughs> Your next turn is insane. Uh, 
we're gonna hit like a one mana spell. I guess. Versus Valera. Watch. Your sacrifice will be for naught. Bad. Monsters beneath you. Mm. Oh, oh. No gems is really the game. Oh 
Good start from them. The time has come to throw our former master. Has come to our former master. All right, I need them to like not kill me for two turns. Unlikely. <laughs> this is a lot of stats. Wait, what? Oh, that ruins my life, chat. Like that literally ruins my life. <laughs> oh god, I'm so dead. Well, that's the crypt keepers, the nuts, though. I can play it and then not die. Actually, if we can go Crystal Clutter, then we can go uh, UNR and then uh, Shared Reflections and we'll be okay. I thought Twitch chat ruined me, dude, that maybe. Why didn't I kill that? Whoops. Wait, was that at one health? How did I miss that? Oh, well, I'm gonna die. Oh wait, I don't know. We could buff up this, I guess, so. I guess it was only a five attack, technically. Any thoughts on the current meta? Uh, no! Chat, this meta is the worst meta of all the time. Wait, did they just F up here? Yeah, they did. I missed the three damage face here. It's a huge deal. Might mean a difference between life and death. That's insane pickup chat. Right. I bestow these gifts upon the world. The virtue of the wild. I bestow these gifts upon the world. I bestow these gifts upon the world. The beauty. Chad, this is kind of illegal. Oh, 
Uh, Chad, this is what's so evil about the deck. It's just like Eonar over and over and over again. Ugh. It's so evil. Like, I've been on that side so many times. You like, you've won the game. You're putting so much pressure on them, and they just do this Eonar play. But even in a cold deal fight, like, didn't matter. Like they're gonna remove this, and I'm gonna redevelop. No big deal. You know what I mean, Chad? They should give charge. <laughs> righteous, even. That's a good point. Yeah, it is very righteous. I bestow these gifts upon the world. The virtue of the wise. Unfortunately for us. Hmm. Do I want to go for like infinite fizzles here or? I bestow these gifts upon the world. The virtue of the wild. I bestow these gifts upon the world. The beauty of nature. Mm. Just dump this. Oh, this. I guess I can get like fizz Finley in my fizzle and then I can go Finley's and just use due process to win at some point, so. This is like how to lo lose the game when oh, guaranteed to win. So I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna resist the urge, chat. I don't think I actually want to draw. My power I don't grows. actually want to. Um, I don't actually want to play due process here. The reasoning is 
they have no value here. So like due process just kind of can actually help them. Um, so. You never fix fun garden. Wait, that's wait. Oh, I could steal this chat. Okay, chat. Okay, now we pick the fun play. Okay. All right. Wait, wait, wait. What the sec heck? Um, have they played? Um. Wait. This is uh. Do I? Okay, chat. Do I steal the student of the stars here? Or do I steal the uh, the Scourge Illusionist? Chat, I want to steal the Student of the Scars. It's like way more fun. Even though like this is the right steal. Like, <laughs> all right, I'm, I'll do the right play, Chat. I'll do the right. We, we can steal this Death Rattle, like the Scourge Illusionist. Where I can see them. Uh, this is the this is the destroy their will to live play though. Like stars never even gets the cool the cool stuff. Like, Chad. Like now it's like over. Like they concede here. You know I don't know. Oh, wait, they didn't even draw their freaking 4 3 here. Well played. They're conceding. Alright, now I like this deck's pretty good. Trapdoor spider or infected peasant here? It's probably infected peasant. That's more annoying, right? Like I'm looking at my early game plays. They are, yeah. Uh, this can't be good. This is so annoying. Like these minions. Yeah, do I just throw it on the due process right now? 
What do you guys think? Like, uh, I feel like I have a ramp advantage. What do you guys think? I'm gonna do it. I am Manalus. Please, please help me. Like, I feel this is more awkward for them. I have Topio coming down. Like, I have a hand that works really well with due process, where like they might have a hand that works less well, you know? It can backfire, yeah, but like it makes it sense game theory wise. Like, um, we're playing I mean, so like I have Topi here, so I have board control uh pretty much all game. I have cards that are very easy to, to get rid of. Too, you know, so good. I could even go like nourish into like shattered reflections on my topiar. Um, if they don't remove it here, which a lot of times they don't, like a lot of times they just play their own topiar, right? Game theory wise, okay, game theory is like, so, uh, like the theory of, uh, like, it's kind of like in theory, my opponent has, uh, more cards in their deck, um, I have, like, they have more cards in their hand, I have less cards in my hand, I have very well defined plays already, but I could use draw, so it makes sense, like, on a game theory level, to do the play. Basically. Like, doesn't this hand seem like it works well with the, um, with our, our plan, you know? So. <clears throat> Triple Topia here is going to be so good, like. Game theory optimal, uh, including incomplete information, yeah. Um. In practice, it might not work out. Right? In practice, it might be like, oh, I should have saved the due process if I had known. So now we don't actually know the game theory in this spot. This is a very like new spot, you know, but like in chess or something like very well known situations, you might have like really well defined game theory on things, you know. Uh, so example of like game theory optimal versus a suboptimal like bad gammon. Um, if you get six and one on turn one, like a lot, a lot of players will, pro players will put their six down to their five, even though it's technically uh, like a, a worse move because they just kind of basically, um, they basically kind of just like the play. Puts them in a sit show. Um, like game theory optimal lineup might be like the best statistical lineup into a tournament, but bringing a suboptimal lineup might be um, uh, like bringing decks that aren't as good statistically that you're really good at, and you think you can like make your opponents like crack under the pressure. Um, a lot of players would bring like these like really complicated control decks, and their weaker opponents. Wouldn't be able to handle it. Um, so, great tip would be don't lose. Wait, what? What's going on here? Wait, did I play three topiers, chat? Why did I only make two here? Oh, no, 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 I've made two topiers. Okay, this makes sense. <laughs> Whoops.
Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Um, I'm trying to, like, not draw cards here, because it's, like, um, with Aquatic if I don't have to. Um, I'd love to get Fizzle, though, because it's, like, getting my Reno and my, uh, this guy and my Fizzle would be really good. They're going Solar Dew here. Is this play ever correct? I feel like this play is... I mean, I'm going to draw 80... I draw 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 cards next turn now, so... I guess they don't know that I don't have... Um, I don't have Fiddling... I, they don't know I have Fiddling Hand here, so... Can't I make them draw like an insane amount of cards too here, chat? Um, okay, okay, okay. Chat, I kind of want to go solar due process myself. <laughs> Just pedal to the metal. I have Finley left by side of my hand. Contemplation. I take actually do I take audio amplifier here? I could take Eonar, but like Eonar just clogs up space on the board. Audio amplifier seems more useful here. Alright, let's see what <laughs> it's gonna be a hell of a game. Alright, let's see what they overdraw here. My hand is too uh useless cards. Quadic actually is Okay, overdraw because that's cost mana or it doesn't cost mana, so it's easy to get out of their hand. But if I just don't overdraw Fizzle, because then I get. Heal, and you don't have to worry about overdrawing. Why would I need to hear takes up infra board space? Yeah, I don't think I want that. Like I have double topier here, so um and this makes my hand bigger, makes it like more likely I get a fizzle down. So if I get a fizzle down on for Finley, it's like an automatic win. Cause I'll get like just like ridiculous I'll get so much more I get another twenty to fatigue. Um, basically. Ooh, it's another topier. Okay, 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 okay. Do I even want to play the other Topier here? Not really. Um, I think this is what I want to do. I'm just going to get rid of this out of my hand because uh, I want to be able to draw. I guess I'll take Eonar here now. A little face with all this. I want to improve my chances of. Um... It's hard, like, they can never really get on board here. Why not trade the one four away? Because that My means I don't get to go face. It's going like this one four is not doing shit. Uh, so I'd rather go face. So, what do you rather have? Four or six damage to face, or four or six damage to that minion? Like one four doesn't do anything.
you know, I, um, Did that just move losing that Finley just is how to lose move. here. Mm, okay. Uh, I lost my fizzle chat. I guess I could go like, all right, let's just start trading things off. I don't know who wins this. I have Finley, which is helpful. And they're taking like so much. Okay, they're taking like infinite fatigue damage right now, so. Your minions betray you. Your minions betray you. One who did burn Fizzle. Yeah, but. So we'll see if they can pull. Fizzle's insane, right? Okay. I just do the same play in a follow up situation, right? Make it so they can't get bored here, I think. And then, um... Well, looking for a standoff? Careful! It's against me! I do say! I seem to have known the purpose! Getting a little light on cards here! I guess what's nice is because they're fizzled, if they go the five mana spell, they can't play it this turn, right? So, we've got that going. Like, yeah, if they play the five mana spell, they can't... Wait, they're gonna hero power my face here? Oh no. Wait, don't they take infinite fatigue damage though next turn though? So this, by the way, I think this play might not actually work. I'm not sure. <laughs> Chat, we'll see. We'll see if we can still win. Um,
versus Gul'dan! Your soul shall be mine! My dreaming ends. Your nightmare begins. <laughs> Never got initiative, yeah. But like, I mean, we kind of won with the fatigue as well, so it kind of like combined. We just really, yeah. We made it so. Like, like with Triple Topia, we never really need to draw cards, which was nice because like all our cards were infinite value. By high rogue wild growth, we win this game so hard. I did not. So I'm debating chat just sheer powering so I can go coin this into this and then I can get another 10 armor. But it might not just be worth it. Because like... Ooh, that's a painful that they have to do that play. They're really weak if they're doing that play, right? Uh, keep her here, it's nice. You cannot crack my carapace. We draw you and Arby win the game as well. The overture is upon us. I don't know if that's a good play. I could have gone audio and then gone like solar, the, the six drop next turn, which has some advantages. But now I just get to go Yogg and you try and full clear. It's not bad. I mean, because like clearing board is valuable. Love it. Still, Unar ends it. My fee chat. Uh, I do think solar due process might be useful here. Contemplation. 
My guy didn't even die here? Okay, what do I do now? Um... Chat, we do for the culture. Uh, the Beetle version. Um, so I don't really uh, have enough information. Uh, it's been shown though, it, it, Beetle version is good enough to be top number one legend. Uh, so I think we don't. It's hard for me to think that the Beetle version would be better in the mirror. So uh, like, uh, so I, I wonder if it has like a. My my best uh, guess is that it has a different matchup spread. So in theory, if you're like bringing it to a tournament, you can like uh, change your like. Let's say you're let's say it's bad in the mirror. You could ban uh, Druid and then do better in the mirror. Uh, stuff like that. I don't actually know, but like it doesn't look that like it changes the the win rates overall that much. Um, but yeah. I'm not sure if forging here is correct here. It's like, okay, is it just me or is for like coin forging? Like, there's no way that's correct in my opinion. The coin's way more valuable, right? Like, what world do you go coin forge in Brace of Nature? Unless you're like an aggro deck and you just got something else done with it, I don't know. The seeds are so even okay even with this like i just don't agree all right high roll top decks let's go consume 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 is funnel cake ever good here for like free mana we'll go with sharon gardens I don't know, is that smart? I'm in an awkward situation here too, because it's like... Like having Finley on the left side of your hand, remember, is insane for the mirror, but... Very favored Rogue. Yeah, I also feel very favored with this list, but like, I could see that. Um... Uh... But yeah, you probably have to control the board, like... But... I don't know what like what advantages the beetle list has. I'm kind of just trusting the uh I don't really want to keep on panning, right? It's like...
We're in such an awkward spot. See what I hit here. I hit Topier, that's good. Wait, was, was I supposed to take Fizzle there? I probably was supposed to just take Fizzle there, actually. It's hard taking Fizzle there. This play is really good, though. Okay, this play is insane, because I get two of my ten attacks, right? Okay, maybe not taking Fizzle is fine. Let's go for Tempo. Default plan. This is the best Druid deck? Um, yes. I'm gonna say yes. Now, to, to, you can make, you can redefine what best is, but this is, uh, this is the best one. Token Druid, really strong at the moment. Uh, Token Druid's really, really good. Uh, except when you play at my ranks and nobody's playing it. So it must be not that good. But it's like an absurd win rate at the climb. I don't think it's that good at top 1000. I think you're better off playing aggro demon hunter. Um... Why do I want to just like YOLO face with my guys here? See if this is good. How close am I to being a Highlander deck here? Uh, one card. That's nice. Wait, no, no, I have no more two Naga Giants in my deck now, so. Ooh, okay. This fizzle is great because now I can copy the fizzle, right? Um, and then I have. Copying the fizzle is insane because then I have multiple fizzles. Okay, I actually wrecked this now. Cause I just steal the fizzle and then I have Reno and fizzle on the left side of my hand, right? Yeah, they have to trade here, right? Like it's brutal for them. Take a picture of this. So the left of my side of my hand is like Reno and and Finley, which is kind of insane. Cause uh Yeah. And I have Topier down, like I have so many advantages here. So I can get like so many Finleys now, right? Like Everybody. 
They get like they can do this play, but like here's what's hard about this play. I feel like, okay, um, I actually want to draw here. Wait, another fizzle chat. Okay, I, I take the another fizzle here. Because the more fizzles, the merrier. Probably just supposed to dump you and I there, but so I have two fizzles in my deck now. I don't want to play the due processes. I don't actually want to speed this match up up yet. Um, like they they are low on value, you can feel it. So they have to do plays like this, and then I wait for them like to get a giant hand here. Okay, double interve is pretty brutal. I wait for them to like get a giant hand or something. Like yeah, they're drawing a ton of cards and then I can like go in on the due processes. Okay, wow, they're drawing a lot of cards here now. Okay, now I think I can go in. We lost Yogg. Okay, there I can yeah. <clears throat> Is that all you can do, dude? Really? Wow. But I'm not slow. All right, time to go. All, time to go in on due processes, chat. Ooh. Do I go in on due processes, or do I just um, or do I just yog here? Like yog seems pretty good. Like I can just chill a little. Actually, I can go in on one, one due process. Are you thinking? Uh, I'm gonna play. I want a yog though. Like. So I get to put. I get to push uh, ten face now, right? Yeah. Playing more due processes. This is weird. Um, okay, okay. Um,
magic of life. Dude, that's so frustrating. Okay, okay. Um, I could go. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, 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 okay. I could go Finley now, um, and then take, and then take the snapshot for two. Cause I know I have it in my deck. And then, um... Why use snapshot now to get Reno out? Like I'm not gonna have like, like with due processes, there's no point in conserving value. It's not gonna work. So. What do I do with all these cards? You can see we're overdrawn here. We got another Reno though. Um, Crazy, it just might work. I'm fast here. I'm just waiting it out a little bit. Not enough room. Not enough room. That's our first topier like 80 turns later. There's not enough room.
enough room. Getting a little light on. I'm out! Star Fox is in 54 months. Get that sub training. So much Star Fox. I have another um, Finley in my uh, fizzle here, so. I get to like unmill my deck, and I know it's on the left side of my deck too, so. I just don't have like them. I think they have to go like Reno into Fizzle here to survive. But. Yeah, this is over, right, chat? There's no winning line, I don't think, at this point, like with five mana. I don't know if there was some miraculous thing, but normal game of her stun here. Like they do this play with Finley maybe, but like I'm now just pushing tons of damage, right? So it doesn't actually work here in my opinion. <clears throat> Don't know if this kills him or not. Wait, what? We'll see. Can only play one card on their board, so it's tough, right? Do you have a way to get their Finley down here? Okay, we win. Nice. Camp's so small today. I don't know, dude. Look at that. Look at this fatigue, and the funny thing is we're gonna... <laughs> we just took so much, and we didn't even get through our armor, which is crazy. So this is what I mean, like Pocket Train says like the Beetle version is good against Rogue. I'm like 4-0 against Rogue with this version. That's what I mean when I'm like, I'm not really convinced like, but his version might be slightly more, but like, yeah, so. We 
Yeah, Beetle is fast. That's probably I just like this one better for stylistic reasons. If I'm being honest with myself, chat. <laughs> On Trains TV, thank you for the two months. Again, let's stop training so much on Trains TV. Shiny. My shiny. Okay, chat, I don't know why. I don't know why, but like in the last like week, my Google Chrome has been a nightmare. Like, I don't know what happened, but like anytime I try and open up a browser tab, it just completely breaks down. I don't know if anyone is like what it likely could be. I haven't really, I mean, I could just like do a big clean out of my computer kind of thing, but it's like not really other things. It's specifically Chrome that's just like dying. I can't see you guys because my Chrome is like panicking. Yeah, it's still panicking. Dude, Chrome used to be so efficient. I need to switch to like Firefox or something. Like it used to be like when Chrome was like the, the minimalist one back in the day. Like, and I went from like Firefox to Chrome because like, oh, this is even faster. Nowadays, it's like how the mighty have fallen. Oh, my, my, some of my spells are discounted. Oh, that's kind of nice. Oh, 
let's wait on this one. Microsoft chat now that Microsoft owns uh, Blizzard. I'm required to subtly do Microsoft product placement in the stream. All right. Man, my my MacBook Pro sure sucks. Man, Apple used to be great. Not anymore. I really should buy a Windows computer. Maybe I'll do that. crazy like is it is it like they're switching out like microsoft people are taking their jet like because the the merger so no nobody i know i saw at least like they didn't post Breakdance is insane, right? Yeah, Linux, I, did, I wouldn't do Linux, like, but yeah. AI is, do, just, AI is doing most of the work. Do you ever fizzle this hand just to like have a fizzle in your deck? Because it's like nature spells, but I haven't even drawn Topier, so I don't know. Maybe just Finley. I guess what's nice about fizzle is that I can go like all in on due process pretty easily and then get a second Finley. But then I can't play Topier if I draw it this turn, so I don't know if I really like that. I guess I can because I have 11 mana, right? 
Then I can't play Eunar, so I don't know. Probably just go Finley. I don't really need the... Um... Well, now I want to fizzle because I have literally both. I have Reno in my hand now. I need a hell of a turn here. I bestow these gifts upon the world. Oh no! I am I threw chat! Oh no, dude. Why did I throw? Why did I throw chat? I'm like dead, dude. My hand is dude, I'm like, oh god. I like, I saw that, and then I just uh, forgot about it. Uh, it's just, it's literally, I just literally. Now I can't get down like the solar freaking do process. I can't get this solar. Oh my god, dude! What a throw. See, now, nah, right, Ray. If I win this game, you will be banned, though. Chad, I win games that I throw all the time, all right? All right. Embarrassing. Dude, I hate to break it to you, but that's kind of life is making embarrassing mistakes all the time. <laughs> I raise you fall. <laughs> sure. Oh, dead. All right, I'm so dead. Dude! Oh god. Oh uh, god, chat! I had won this game and I threw. Alright. Dude! Alright, this is the right play. They're punishing my throw. Ooh, top deck hang in the game, chat. Oh my god, chat. So lucky. Let's throw a gamer. <laughs> we have plotted long enough. Now we rise. 
Low rolls, please. No gigafin, please. Clock, yes, my boy Clock. Dude, I'm a big fan of this card. Incredibly well balanced card. Chat, we're legit gonna win here. Like, I threw the game and then I got unthrown. Oh my god, chat. I drew this card, okay. So now I just, uh, how many cards? Uh, I don't, I don't want to solar it. I don't need to do that, I guess. Um. Am I Highlander yet? No, I have Embrace of Nature in my deck, okay. I'm just gonna get the card draw going. Stall Charlie, I know, right? Let the badlands burn. They're <laughs> very sad, so. Are you are you being serious? Did Hypnos, the the the, hu the human being, get laid off? I don't know if you're joking. you soon.
All right, chat. I'm going to call it. Thanks, everybody, for hanging out. Uh, I got... I got some sex cult stuff. Sorry, Napalm. Go, oh, cause dude, dude. I just said I'm gonna call it. Um, can someone? Uh, so I gotta go, chat. Talk to you guys later.